Yo, being a family doctor sounds cool. Helping people feel better. You are a good listener. And I don't get grossed out. Here's one way to become a family doctor in Canada. A flowchart. First, work towards your bachelor's degree. Some places are gonna require you to finish it, some won't. But either way, you're gonna need good grades. I'm graduating with a 4.0 GPA in biology, baby. Great, now most times you gotta write the MCAT. The mean score is 500, so you probably want 515 to be competitive. I'll get like 520 easy. Then probably take a Casper test. That focuses on things like empathy and ethics. Why though? You need these to apply to med school, and there's an admissions interview after that too. I'll get in. That's four years of med school focused on family medicine. Then you apply for the MCCQE. What's that? A one day computer test based on what you've learned so far and how you apply it. Then what? While you're finishing med school, you need to apply for a residency and that is hard and it could take a while. What do you mean hard? It's competitive. It's like hands-on training once you finish med school. Think Grey's Anatomy season one. But I finished med school first. Yeah, and then you get an MD, AKA a doctor of medicine. And then I'm a doctor, woo! No, you still have to do your family medicine residency and that'll take a couple years. While you're at it, apply for the licentiate of the Medical Council of Canada. That's so many things to do while I'm doing something else. When you finish your residency, take exams for the College of Family Physicians of Canada. It's been a decade, am I finally a family doctor now? No, you have to apply to your province's regulatory body. They give you the license to practice medicine. And then I'm a doctor. You got it. Now about this rash. You're barely gonna feel it. Ah!